Welcome to 20 Fascinating Facts About Angola. Located on the southwestern coast of Africa, Angola is a country with a rich history, diverse culture, and stunning natural beauty. Join us as we explore some of the most interesting and surprising facts about this amazing destination. Angola is the second largest oil producer in sub-Saharan Africa after Nigeria, and oil accounts for almost 90% of the country's exports. Despite this, Angola remains one of the poorest countries in the world with high levels of inequality and a lack of basic infrastructure in many areas. The Kalangala Falls, which are located in the Malangi province of Angola, are one of the country's most famous natural attractions. They are formed by the Lukala River as it cascades down a series of steep cliffs, creating a breathtaking spectacle of mist and rainbows. Angola has a complex history. It was colonized by the Portuguese in the 16th century and remained a colony until it gained independence in 1975. After independence, the country was plunged into a brutal civil war that lasted for more than 25 years and claimed hundreds of thousands of lives. Despite its natural resources and potential for economic development, Angola remains one of the poorest countries in the world with high levels of poverty, inequality, and unemployment. The government has been working to address these issues, but progress has been slow and uneven. Angola is known for its vibrant culture and music scene. The country has produced many famous musicians, including Banga, Valdemar Bastos, and Teta Lando. The country's music draws on a wide range of influences, including African rhythms, Portuguese fado, and Brazilian samba. As mentioned before, their main dance is the simba. The word comes from the word masimba, which means touching of the bellies. And so, the dance follows the same rules. The simba is also known as the music of the sea. Angola is also home to a number of important wildlife reserves, including Kasama National Park and the Kalangala Game Reserve. These areas are home to a variety of iconic African wildlife, including elephants, lions, leopards, and buffalo. In recent years, Angola has made significant progress in the areas of education and healthcare. The government has been working to expand access to education and improve the quality of healthcare services with a particular focus on reducing infant and maternal mortality rates. While Angola declared independence from Portugal in 1975, due to its unfortunate history as a colony, Angola's official language is Portuguese. However, many of the native languages have been preserved and are still recognized. Among them are Umbundu, Kimbundu, Kikongo, and Chakwi. Thought to be long extinct, the giant sable antelope was recently found in Angola and is a national icon. This enormous animal is famous for its massive horns and broad stature. To paint a picture, males' horns can reach nearly five and a half feet or 165 centimeters. When it comes to youngsters, Angola has a lot. Nearly 70% of the Angolan population is under 24 years old. Unfortunately, war has had a significant impact on the composition of youth. The nation suffered through a 27-year civil war that ended in 2002 and is still bravely recovering from it. When it comes to Angola's cuisine, much of it, it's stew-based. And honestly, what's more comforting than a big hearty bowl of stew that's been simmering all afternoon? Not much. The most common ingredients in the stews are beans, chicken, pork, fish, sweet potato, and okra. Luanda is one of the world's most expensive city for expats. The capital city is also sometimes referred to as the Paris of Africa. Of course, the expenses have got nothing to do with the nickname. There is one tree that is special to Angola. It's called Mbandiero. Popular belief says that God planted this tree, also known as Boabab, upside down. The unusual looking Mbandiero tree can be found growing all over the country and on local artwork. The Angolan flag is red, black, and gold. The red part of the flag represents the blood of Angolans killed in conflicts, the black represents the Angolan people, and the gold star is modeled after the star on the flag of the former Soviet Union. The name Angola derives from the word Gola, which was the title given to Ndongo kings, the historical African kingdom of the Mabundu people founded around the late 15th or early 16th century. During the 17th and 18th centuries, Angola was a significant Portuguese slave trading base. 
Between 1,580 and 1,680, over a million slaves were transported to Brazil. Angolan businesswoman Isabel dos Santos is Africa's richest woman. She is the daughter of the former Angolan president Jose Eduardo dos Santos and is estimated to have a fortune of $2.2 billion. The most popular sport in Angola is basketball. The national basketball team have won many titles in African basketball and hold the record of the most titles. Soccer also, with the national soccer team competing in one World Cup final in 2006. Angola is also a regular contributor to the Olympics. Thanks for watching and learning 20 interesting facts about Angola. I hope you enjoyed this video and gained some new insights about this fascinating country. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more informative content. Until next time.